guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So we haven't done a little kind of sit down haul video in a little while. So I'm actually going on holiday tomorrow. So I bought a couple of things that hopefully if I like them, I can take away with me. Today we are doing a nasty gal haul. Now, I know what you're thinking, I don't have the best of luck when it comes to Nasty Girl. A lot of the stuff just doesn't seem to suit me, it seems a little bit on the cheaper side. But I saw that they bought out a new collection with M. Rata. I picked up quite a few of her bits, I also picked up a couple of different bits as well. So hopefully these are going to be cute. I've definitely got my mind on a couple of things that I know I really liked online. So let's just see if in reality they're actually as nice as I think they're going to be. If you want to see what I picked up from Nasty Girl then please keep on watching. Now as per usual with Nasty Girl, there was a big difference discount on I think it was like 30% off or something like that so I always feel like with Nasty Girl if they were full priced items I don't think I'd pay for them but because they're like discounted even though everything's always discounted they're actually not that bad of a price okay this looks promising so this is a cute little white tie up linen shirt I actually bought this because I bought a co-ord from In The Style which is a whole nother story. I was gonna do a whole video on it in the style, but everything just, I didn't really like anything. So I bought this card from In The Style and the shorts were great, but the top was not great. So I got this top as a kind of a replacement to go with it, if that makes sense. I'll show a picture of what the outfit is and what I'm trying to do with it. The only thing is it's a lot more cream than I thought it was gonna be. It's not like a bright white. It feels like a linen, which is great. I love that kind of linen breathable material, especially when you're in a hot place and you're on holiday and stuff. So yeah, I think this looks really, really nice. I think this is gonna be quite good for holidays as just like a bit of a staple item. I got it in a size 10 and it was 24.50 with the discount, so I mean if that's full price, that's like 30 quid, it's a little bit steep, but 24.50 I think is okay. Okay, what do we think of the shirt guys? I absolutely love it, so this is the shorts that I was talking about from In The Style, they actually match really well, I was quite worried that this would be a lot more cream and this would be a lot more bright white, but I think actually they're a really good match. I love it, this is such a cute little holiday outfit. This top feels like really, really good quality to be honest. Like the linen feels really, really nice. Obviously you can roll up the sleeves, which to be honest, I think I would just keep them long because I like that kind of relaxed, undone kind of feel. But this is so cute and I think it's gonna be a perfect like staple white shirt for summer. This with just like a really like cute, like long, maxi skirt as well like you know like the satin skirts that are in at the moment i think it's going to be absolutely gorgeous so this is a winner we've got off to a really good start nasty girl well done so this top caught my eye straight away and i thought this was actually very m rata kind of style it is a gorgeous little satin style crop top. It's got this gorgeous kind of satin look and then it has obviously ties onto your shoulders, which I think is great because it means it's adjustable. It means you can wear it to fit your size. I just thought this looked really nice and expensive. This with a pair of like big wide leg trousers or even like flared trousers. I've got a pair of pink flared trousers that I think I could wear this with for holiday. Um, I think would be really, really stunning. I got it again in a size 10 and with the discount, it was £24.50. So again, £30 for a little tiny crop top. Mm, a little bit on the pricier side. So yeah, hopefully this fits me and I'm going to be wearing this a lot on holiday. Oh my gosh. So well done, nasty girl. This is beautiful. I absolutely love this. This is so gorgeous and it looks so expensive. Like it looks so much more like expensive than it's just from like an online clothing store. Do you know what I mean? Like I love the tie detail. The only thing I think I could have probably sized down a little bit because it's not kind of like as tight as I'd probably like it to be. Like but that's just my personal preference. I think this is gorgeous. I actually think I would wear this with maybe like a pair of really like big oversized jeans and a pair of little sandals. Even on holiday I think that would look so so beautiful. I am in love with this. This one is a hundred percent being kept because this is gorgeous. I literally looked at this in the bag and I was like what the heck is this? I do not remember buying this. Okay so it is a gorgeous little satin kind of slip style skirt. Um, again, in the Emrata range, it's got a really nice ruching at the front, which I actually love on these kind of style skirts because it means it doesn't like sit really tightly on your figure, so you're not going to see every kind of lump and bump. It kind of sits a little bit more relaxed. But what I thought is quite cool, which I didn't actually notice in the initial picture online, is it's got like this 
kind of beaded fringing at the bottom of the skirt, which I think is such a nice little added touch. I think this is really, really nice. Again, like everything seems to be pretty decent so far. Hopefully this fits me because that's always where it seems to go downhill for me for Nasty Girl. Like the fit is just always a little bit like, oh. I got it in a size 10 and it was £31.50. So I'm guessing this is probably about £35. Not too bad. I think it's very individual and it's very like stylish by itself. So I'm pretty happy with this one. And on the website, they styled that with a band tee. So not usually my kind of thing, but gonna give it a go. I picked up the Purple Rain Prince kind of rocker style tee. Again, I think it's really, really cute. Don't think the quality is too great. The material is quite thin. It's a little bit see-through, but I mean, it's a rocker tee. It's a band tee. It's not like that big of a deal. So yeah, I think this is really, really cute. I am going to try and style it with the skirt and see what it looks like on me. I got it in a size 10 and it was £14. This is the full outfit together and I can't deny it looks really cool like really really cool the skirt is very like individual very different like I love the skirt but it just isn't fitting me that well like it's very very tight on this area and a little bit looser on this area and I don't know it's just it's just not fitting me the greatest which I'm really gutted about because I think it's such a cool skirt and I love it fit wise it's just not really working for my body shape the t-shirt I think is really really cool like the t-shirt and the skirt together is such a good little combo like very good styling by the nasty girl team definitely going to keep the t-shirt and i think i will just style it with with a different satin slip skirt that i have because i do think this is a really cool look but it's just really upsetting that the skirt isn't fitting me right because i think it looks absolutely great anyone that's a little bit less hippie than me i 100 percent recommend picking up this skirt because this is just so so gorgeous and then going on to kind of like the main collection stuff i saw this cute little linen dress and i just thought this was too cute to not pick up this is absolutely gorgeous so it's a mini style dress and then it's got quite like a, a deep plunge at the front which i think is great and then it's also quite cut out on the sides and it's got a cute little like button down detail as well i just thought this looked really really nice it's definitely like that linen feel as well so great for holiday i thought this looked really really cute i don't think you can go very wrong with a little black dress especially on holiday like always just so flattering and always looks great with the tan and oh my god so it's double lined which doesn't normally happen for me on nasty girl which means obviously it won't be see-through which is a really really good thing i'm really happy about that I got this in a size 10 again and it was £22.40p so I think that's actually a really good price. I think maybe because it's the Enrata range like everything is a little bit pricier whereas the main site kind of stuff is a little bit cheaper so I think that's actually a really really good price. Oh my god guys, I literally feel like a million dollars in this dress. I don't know what it is, it's such a nice fit like I feel like this is like perfect for what I love like this is exactly what I want from a little black dress it's quite tight the um the hips and the bum is quite tight but it, it's fitting really good like really good like I'm so happy with this I love the plunge detail it's a little bit loose on the boob because you know I'm not <laughs> I'm not as um, blessed in the boob department. I love the kind of low like back and the sides. Again, like I just, I love that kind of style. It's kind of cool with the buttons as well. So this is the only fastening on the dress. It doesn't have any zips. So that was a little bit annoying, you know, doing up buttons, but I think this is so gorgeous. And as I said, it is kind of a linen kind of fill material. So it does feel quite nice and breathable. It does have also the double layering. So it's very like, black and like you can't see anything through it which is really really great so <gasps> thumbs up nasty girl you are turning things around and i'm so happy for you because i haven't had a great nasty girl haul like this i don't think ever so so this one there's always one of these ones in my hauls like i always have this one item that i'm like why did i get that this again was like a last minute kind of chuck it in the, ba the basket kind of thing it's a denim crop top with like quite a cool kind of cut out bustier detail for your, your boobs and it's obviously a bardo style I do think this is cute. I'm just kind of like, uh, I don't know. Don't know if this is my thing anymore. I don't, I don't know what's putting me off about it. Maybe it's the denim thing. We're gonna have to try this one on. I do think it could work with maybe like with a pair of like big white trousers. 
and some heels and slick hair kind of like this. I'm just not too sure to be honest. It's cute, but I just, I'm not blown away. This I got in a size medium and it was 14 pounds. Hmm. If I'm completely honest, this is just not really anything special. It doesn't fit very well, if I'm completely honest. So like, I don't know, like, I don't know how it's meant to fit. Do you know what I mean? Like it just kind of sits really weirdly. Like it doesn't fit on the boobs, doesn't fit on the waist. It's just a bit weird. It's just kind of not, not great, but yeah. You win some, you lose some, you know? The last two items, which is essentially one outfit, because this is a co-ord, is this gorgeous, now this is one I'm really, really excited about. It's like a broderie style co-ord set. So this is like the skirt, which is kind of like a tiered frill kind of skirt. This skirt reminds me so much of um, Pia Mullenbeck. Pia Mullenbeck. Always wears these kind of style skirts with like cowboy boots and like cowboy hats and it just looks so cool. So yeah, I thought this was really nice. This feels great actually. It feels really thick and full and like good quality. And then I also bought the matching little kind of um, off the shoulder top. <laughs> this one feels a little bit flimsy, a little bit thin, um, but I think I think this is going to work and I think this is going to be such a cute holiday outfit as well, especially for Italy, like walking down the streets in Italy, I think this is going to be so gorgeous. So yeah, I think this is really great. I am really happy with close to everything that I've picked up, so fingers crossed this all looks great. The skirt I got in a size 8 and it was £28 and the top I got in a size 10 and it was £17.50. And this is the final outfit. I think this is really really sweet. I think this is cute. I'm just not overly blown away I guess. I think the black dress just literally blew everything out of the water for me and now I'm like because whereas actually I think I would normally quite like this, like this is a very me kind of style. I love the cord. I think it looks very kind of relaxed, chilled, kind of peasanty vibes, which is so up my street. I don't know what it is that's putting me off. I think maybe it could be like the ruching. I don't know if that makes it look a bit cheap. Do you know what I mean? But I, I do really like this and I think this would look really cute in Italy. My vibes was kind of like Tash Oakley, kind of like beach vibes, walking along, drinking a glass of wine. Just so you can see guys, it is like a full length maxi skirt. So like it literally goes all the way down to the tops of your toes, like literally hits your ankles. Do you think this is cute? I think with a bit of an iron, it will make this look a little bit more expensive because at the moment I'm thinking maybe it looks a bit cheap and that's why I'm not loving it so much. I don't know. I'm just not as blown away as I am by everything else, so. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that haul. If you did, then please give this video a thumbs up. It really, really helps out my channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I do vlogs, I do fashion, I do health, I do fitness, I do whatever I'm feeling like at the moment. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I cannot wait to see you in the next one.